everyone. Today we're going to paint a cute giraffe. All right, let's start. Today's color we need white, blue, brown, yellow, red, black. Okay, let's start with a two inches brush, and we prepared our paper first. Okay, with blue and white. We put a lot of more white to make it lighter blue. And then you just can go back and forth, make it both sides of the brush have a lot of paint, okay? So, and we just go like up and down, use both sides of the brush, okay? And then we cover all the paper and then we wait until it's dried up and we come back for more. Here I add a little bit dark blue on the top and bottom corner. Did not show in the video. You can do it or without it. All right, it's all dried up, and then we get a pencil and sketch out the giraffe. Okay, you need to set where are the giraffe is. So where the head, where's the ear, where's the leg. No need to be exact. All right, it's just the shape out. That's it. And then you can draw a bit smaller and skinnier. All right, later on you can fix it easier. And here we find a half inch brush or quarter inch brush it depends okay and you just use a tiny touch bit yellow mix into the white okay we want a little bit beige color we do the first layer of the giraffe so i'm slowing down with the face here and then later on we'll speed it up but you have your own time okay you can pause the video and do it your own and then when you're done, you start continue washing the rest, okay? So uh, take your own time. Uh, right now, no details. We just cover everywhere we sketch out the giraffe with the same color. All right, now we bring some coloring. I excited. Now you get some uh, brown and a little bit black on the side. Wait, okay? And we use a tiny touch bit brown mix into the color we have before okay and then we're going to shape up the edges uh, when you shape up the edges with the same brush and you can change to a smaller brush if you are comfortable with and if you are using the same brush remember make the brush really pointy and then just use the point okay to shape up and then right now I make some a little bit lighter color to do the dot on the giraffe, okay? The spot. So in the spot where located, you design, okay? And then you can copy my, and then you can design where to put them. No need to be exact and uh, same, okay? And you can design what color. See, I put it somewhere with a touch bit yellow and somewhere with dark brown a little bit. And then later on, the first layer, we put all light color. And then later on, we get dark color, we put it in. And that will make the spot show a little more. See, like here, I'm putting the dark spot in. You see the spot start to show up, okay? So the first layer is light color. And then we add dark color, all right? Yeah, here to get a little bit dark color for the feet, okay? And just on the bottom here a little bit dark color so uh, do this paint you need to switch light color and dark color very often okay so and uh, because of the spot you have to change light color and dark color so you can put a set of brushes on the side you know that will be easier is if not you just had to um, yeah put it a point very touch on the brush point the color so don't press too hard and that way you can get the color just using the top point color okay there we go and we ship up the legs and okay the foot also i just make a circle a dark circle around the shape we have before to shape up a little bit and then on the leg the top part put some light color and yeah just like that and then we're going to put a spot also on the legs and the head okay 
and here pay a little more attention on the face here because this face we had to shape up with a different color uh, to make uh, the shape of the face okay like the cheek and the, where the eye is where the forehead okay all that it have dark shadows so in this part pay a little more attention where i put the light color see like now the mouth area i put a light color almost like um, the bottom color we have before but i add in a little more color and to shape up the face here you don't have to draw super thin lines because anyway the back of the face have some shadows okay and so and the giraffe is so cute it has big cheeks okay so that part and uh, we need to show so that's why we need different color to show that all right all right here we draw the ear out yeah just like that and then we put some dark color on the on only the outside of the ear only the little part okay and then we leave the middle blank later on we're going to put some pink color and then we're going to do a few that on the face here and also this the color you can control it okay you want a dark spot you want a lighter spot you want a yellow color so it depends what you want okay you design them so don't be afraid and then you can cover them easily okay say so like here i just add a little bit more white to make the face stand out okay and then here we're going to draw the horn here and just a touch a little ball there and we just draw it with brown color and then now we get a smaller brush we're going to age out the inside ear okay just yeah and then put some dark lines outside and then we put some hair here and there you know giraffe have a hair right yeah we shape up the face a little more and then here I like to use the thinner brush as possible. But you can use the same brush, okay, no problem. Because it's hard to control the same one. And then you can just use your brush, just touch, very gently press the brush, okay? So you can draw thin lines. Yeah and here i also put some hair when you want to do a super thin line you just add in some water in the color okay thinner the color a little bit and so that way you can really very thin lines draw all right see like that you can draw hair like that all right and i will show just a few part over the draw the hair so um this is the same way okay you just have to choose a different directions where the hair goes so which way the hair go so and all right here we change to a little bit bigger brush and for you guys it's still the small brush okay and then we got to touch a little bit red into the white color to make light light pink and then as you see i start on the bottom and then take up and that way we leave the white spot on top and also i put one side with pink okay and the ear we did the same thing all right you from the bottom of the ear and goes out and then leave the outside part still the same color as before and then the cheek here we add in a little bit pink to make the face color all right very touch bit pink you see almost like a white color is we lighter than the one we put on the tummy okay and then here you see where yeah and the red part is really later on i add in all right here we draw the eye you can draw smaller first because if you're not sure how big the eye should be and then it will look better and you can also use a pencil draw it out first and then you just fade it up and be careful with the eyebrow here because it's very tiny okay so do it slowly and you can fix the shape a little bit all right 
And then here, I need to switch back to the same brush I want to do the mouse. It's a smile, but it's very thin, okay? For you, you can do it a little thicker, no problem, all right? And we go on, go shape up the spot a little bit on the outside. Very thin lines curve around here and there. No need to cover the full spot, just part of it, see? Now our giraffe looks so cute already. <laughs> We're going to add a little bit more details in. All right, see here a few cute hair on the head. Yeah, there we go, stick it out. And then we're going to add a few on the ball there, okay? And then we also shape up a little bit there. So and that part, if you cannot do it, just leave it. It's fine. All right, here we'll draw a few hair on the ball also, on both of them. Yeah, just put it here and there. And put a little bit more on the ears, all right? And then you can use a little bit thicker one, just put it here and there. And we also need to put a spot on the leg. Here, I just speed it up and then you take your own time to do it, okay? I don't want you to stay in the video so long. And then here on the ear, I add a little bit yellow in to make uh, the color brighter. It look prettier this way, okay? And you can decide to not to, okay? No problem. With the color all in your hand, okay? And we just add a little bit more details and our giraffe will be done, okay? Is it cute? And we shape up the inside ear a little bit more. And then now let me show you something important. Just touch a little bit white on the eyeball, okay? You see? And it's spring alive, isn't it? And here add a few white dots on the horn also. Alright, on the foot. Just draw a few lines, okay? Not too many and don't cover everywhere. See? You did it the cute giraffe, all right? And our lesson will be end right here. And I will see you in my next video. Remember, subscribe my channel. Don't miss out the new videos, okay? Share with your friends.